Have you ever wondered what was the last view captured by NASA's Mars helicopter before its demise? Well, brace yourself for a journey back in time to a moment when ingenuity, that innovative Mars craft, soared above the red planet one final time. Our story begins on a chilly Martian day in the late December of 2023. Ingenuity, the small experimental chopper, was embarking on its 70th flight. Despite the wear and tear of 70 strenuous missions, it managed to ascend once more, reaching an altitude of 39 feet. From this vantage point, it captured an awe-inspiring panorama of the Martian desert. Imagine a vista of sprawling sand dunes stretching as far as the eye can see. The monotonous red-brown scene is broken by rock-strewn ridges and mountains etched against the horizon. The vastness of this alien landscape is overpowering and eerily beautiful. And if you look closely, in the upper left corner of the image, you can spot a small detail, a part of the helicopter's leg, a testament to the heights ingenuity had achieved. Yet this breathtaking view was not just a spectacle of Martian beauty. It held a clue to ingenuity's impending fate. The seemingly serene flowing dunes were in fact a formidable adversary. The helicopter navigated using software that tracked the movement of objects below like rocks. But this sandy terrain was largely featureless, making successful navigation a challenge. Ingenuity, in its perseverance, had embarked on a journey that was more treacherous than it appeared. The featureless terrain that added an element of mystery and allure to the Martian landscape was not just a sight to behold, but also a puzzle to solve, a challenge to conquer. This remarkable aerial view was snapped on December 22, 2023, with its final flight taking place less than a month later. Little did we know then that this would be one of the last glimpses of Mars that Ingenuity would provide us. But what a glimpse it was. A testament to the wonder of exploration and the relentless pursuit of knowledge, even in the face of adversity. But what led to the downfall of this historic Mars craft, you may ask? The answer lies in the very beauty that Mars presents. The picturesque, flowing Martian dunes, as mesmerizing as they are, were likely the cause of Ingenuity's demise. Ingenuity, a marvel of modern space exploration, was not only designed to fly in the thin Martian atmosphere, but also to navigate its way across the alien landscape. To do this, it relied heavily on a sophisticated software that tracked the movement of objects below like rocks. This allowed it to chart its course, adjust its flight path, and ensure a safe landing. However, Mars had a surprise in store. The Martian landscape, dominated by sprawling sand dunes, posed an unexpected challenge. Unlike the rocky terrain that Ingenuity was designed to navigate, the sandy terrain was largely featureless. Imagine trying to find your way in a vast desert with no landmarks in sight. That's the kind of challenge Ingenuity faced. The Martian dunes did not provide the distinct features that Ingenuity's software needed to track and navigate. Without these features, Ingenuity was like a sailor lost at sea, without stars to guide its course. The terrain devoid of prominent features made it incredibly difficult for Ingenuity to determine its position and direction. This led to what NASA refers to as an anomalous landing, a diplomatic term for a crash landing. In essence, Ingenuity was defeated by the very element it was designed to conquer, the Martian landscape. The sand dunes with their flowing and featureless surface proved to be an unexpected adversary. They were the David to Ingenuity's Goliath, showing us once again that in the realm of space exploration, it's not just the big, obvious challenges that can cause problems. Sometimes it's the subtle, unexpected ones that prove to be the most formidable. The more featureless the terrain is, the harder it is for Ingenuity to successfully navigate across it, NASA said in a statement. A fitting tribute to a historic craft that met its end, not due to a failure of technology, but due to the unexpected challenges posed by the alien beauty of Mars. So, how did the final flight of Ingenuity play out? Let's delve into the story of Ingenuity's 72nd flight, a journey that ended far from the smooth landing we'd grown to expect. This small experimental chopper, designed to withstand the harsh Martian environment, took to the skies for what would be its last flight. 
As it ascended, the Martian landscape spread out beneath it, a vista of sprawling sand dunes and rock-strewn ridges. Everything appeared normal, just another routine flight. But then, something went awry. As Ingenuity began its descent, the conditions on the Martian surface posed a challenge like none it had faced before. The land below, a sea of sand, offered little for Ingenuity's navigation software to latch onto. Unlike the rocky terrain it was used to, this sandy landscape was largely featureless, offering no identifiable objects for the software to track. The more featureless the terrain, the harder it becomes for Ingenuity to navigate across it. This, NASA explained in a statement, was likely the root cause of the anomalous landing. As Ingenuity neared the ground, it struggled to find its bearings, and then the inevitable happened. The chopper landed roughly, far from the gentle touchdown we'd come to expect. The impact was severe, leaving at least one of its rotors severely broken. There was the possibility that the rotor tip had snapped off, possibly from crashing into the rocky ground. The damage was extensive. The once agile chopper that had danced in the Martian skies was now grounded, its rotor broken and its body battered. The Mars craft that had given us such magnificent views of the Martian surface that had soared above Mars, capturing images like none before, was left too damaged to ever fly again. And thus the historic Mars craft was left too damaged to ever fly again. The final flight of Ingenuity marked not just the end of an incredible journey, but also the beginning of a new chapter in our exploration of the Martian landscape. What does this final image captured by Ingenuity signify? A question that echoes through the minds of many as we gaze upon the Martian landscape, immortalized through the lens of a grounded helicopter. This final snapshot is not just a mere picture, it's a testament to the triumphs and tribulations of Ingenuity's mission. The detailed view of the sprawling Martian desert, with its sand dunes and rock-strewn ridges, is a treasure trove of data for future Mars missions. The way the light plays off the sands, the arrangement of rocks, the contours of the ridges, each element offers a wealth of information about the Martian environment and its geological history. This image, captured from a height of 39 feet, provides a unique perspective that would have been impossible to achieve from an orbiter or a rover. But the significance of this image isn't limited to its aesthetic appeal or the geological secrets it may hold. This image, and indeed Ingenuity's mission overall, has greatly contributed to our understanding of Mars. It has shown us that we can fly a helicopter in an alien atmosphere, a feat that was once considered impossible. It has also highlighted the challenges of Martian navigation, especially over featureless terrains, paving the way for improvements in future mission designs. Perhaps most importantly, this final image stands as a symbol of the relentless human spirit. It's a reminder of our insatiable curiosity, our desire to expand the boundaries of knowledge, and our willingness to take risks in the pursuit of discovery. It's a testament to the ingenuity, pun intended, of the scientists and engineers who turned a seemingly audacious dream into a reality. While ingenuity may no longer be in operation, its contributions to space exploration are undeniable. Its final image serves as a testament to its historic mission and the potential for future exploration of Mars. So, as we bid farewell to this remarkable craft, let's not forget the significant strides it has helped us make in our journey to understand the Red Planet better.